<coughs> Hello, Ricardo. Hello, good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine. It's, uh, just uh, waiting for this, the, the, this class. <laughs> All right, good. How was your day? It was a uh, to, to resolve many problems. It's, uh, in this moment, I the raw material is cotton. We have to classification for all of for other, but it's a it's a season very very hard for me in my job. Okay, Ricardo, do you have a fan in front of you? Yes. Okay, because it, it it's uh, the air is making noise when you speak. Ah uh, yes. So you sound like this. Yes. <laughs> okay. Okay, now much better this now. Moment is off. Okay, thank you. Nice, thank you. Okay. Um, hello, Nelson. Hello, teacher. How are you? Hello. Good evening. Fine, teacher, and you? I'm okay, thank you. Okay, good. Hey, Nelson, you look a little like Clark Kent. The Superman, <laughs> <laughs> the Superman from the 80s. <laughs> what was his name? What was his name? Um, Christopher uh, Reeve, uh, right? Really? <laughs> Is a fat, a fat, a fat man or, or what? <laughs> no, Christopher Reeve, the original Superman. <laughs> the Superman, no, I don't remember. But you, you never saw Superman, Christopher Reeve from the eighties. He, in fact, he died. Yes. He had oh, an accident okay. and he fell from a horse, so. I think he broke his bone. It was sad, his story, but that's the original Batman, uh, Superman. I remember uh, the, I don't know uh, what uh, uh, movie, but for Superman, because uh, there are- uh, There are many. Four or five, many, yeah, but but not the new ones the maybe, old ones. maybe the, the third i remember when 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 he and another person uh, are in in a in a cave cave uh oh yeah ice, ice yes. cave yes that's the that's christopher reeve uh, okay but like, if you put glasses yeah. on, you look, you would look like Clark Kent. <laughs> yeah. But I, I, I don't like use uh, wear wear glasses. Oh, okay. But uh, I, 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 I have to to use wear. Sorry, because uh, I, I feel that uh, my eyes uh, need to to zoom. <laughs> yeah, I mean, your eyes get tired. For, and that's, your eyes do get yeah. tired. And hello, Carla, yeah. how are you? After uh, after the, after 40, 40 years? Yeah, it's, it's necessary. Yes, it's true, it is. What about you, Carla, how are you? Very long day, but is finished yeah just one more day to go and, and you're set <laughs> now i see you. hello ingrid how are you we lost ingrid we have veronica Oh, there she is. Hi, Ingrid. We have Inmar, we have Ruth. Okay, now everybody's connecting. Nice. Hi, good night. Good evening. Good evening, yeah. Remember, good night is only to say goodbye. Yes. Yeah, thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, okay. Hi, Ruth, how are you? Hi, I am fine, thanks. 
Yeah, you're not eating today, Chuko. <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm eating early. <laughs> no, mm -hmm. I am drinking Chuko early. <laughs> All right, okay, cool. <laughs> nice. Hey, what's up, Gio? How you doing, teacher? I'm okay, thank you. Hey, you're back, you're back to black. Yeah. You're yeah. back in black. <laughs> yes. All right. Okay, so um, today we're gonna learn about, we're gonna learn a little bit about modals. I think we've done them um, a few times before. And um, hey, check this out, Gio. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey, <laughs> you have a light, what is that? It, it's a lamp for a laptop. Ah. So you put it uh, okay. for the okay. keyboard. Hey. But nice. it's cool, I look. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This is my toy. I hide it from my son because if not, he'll take it. To light the keyboard. I'm sorry? To light the keyboard. Yes. <laughs> yes, it's for the keyboard. Okay. Um, today we're going to do a little bit about modals. Do you remember what modals are? Can, could, should, yeah. would. Would. Can. Have to. Must. must. All right. That's what we're going to do today a little bit. Oh, I watched the game yesterday, the Barca game. Man, that was good. All the goals. Okay, do you see my screen? Yes. Yes. All right, yes. nice. So it says, by the end of the session, participants will be able to use models to express degrees of certainty, obligation, advice, and opinion. Okay, so certainty, obligation, advice, or opinion. Okay. Let's watch the video. Hello, let me remind you the models may express degrees of certainty, obligation, suggestion, advice, or opinion. I suggest for you to stay and learn a little bit more. Model auxiliaries express many different meanings or moods. Models can express degrees of certainty. What's that noise? It must be the phone, almost 100% sure. It might be the phone, less than 50% sure. It could be the phone, less than 50% sure. Models can also express obligation, advice, or opinions. You must be on time for the interview. Obligation, it's very cold, you should wear a hat. Advice, everyone should visit Paris once in their life. Opinion. Use models to write reactions to these situations. You and your friend planned to meet, but your friend never arrived. Number two, you loaned a classmate a lot of money last week, but she still hasn't paid you. Okay, let's do this. It might be the phone, less than 50% sure. It could be the phone, less than 50% sure. Okay, let me go back to this one. Press obligation, advice, or opinions. You must be on time for the interview. Be the phone. Okay. So let's do must, might, and could. What is certainty? Certeza. Okay. So let's make it easier. Might and could is the same thing. Might and could. Must. Might and could is about certainty. When you say must, you are very, very sure. You're not 100% positive. I mean, because there's no idea of must. You would say, where is, where is Carlos? I don't know. He must be sick. 
But if you know he is sick, then we don't need to say you must because then you're sure. So he is sick. So when you say he must, it's um, you're very sure. Might and could is the same. He might be sick. He could be sick. Okay. Um, let's do an example. Um, Ricardo. Okay. Ingrid has cried all day today, listening to Luis Miguel and eating, uh, a, and eating a lot of uh, chocolate ice cream. It's by the... <laughs> Uh, uh, fall, fall in love with Luis Miguel. <laughs> no, but she's been crying. Uh, yeah, Listening yeah. to Amanda Miguel. <laughs> Amanda Miguel. Uh, Richard Marx. Paquita, <laughs> but, no, like depression, depression. Uh, <laughs> depression. It might be, it might be, <laughs> yeah, it might be heartbroken. <laughs> she might be heartbroken. Okay, yeah. yeah, you can say she might be or she could be. She could be. I am most certainly that she must be. She must be. Because if you say, man, what? She's, she's, she's been crying. Yeah. Listening to Paquita La del Barrio and eating chocolate ice cream. Oh, man, she <laughs> must be broken. She must be heartbroken. Broken. <laughs> Her boyfriend. <laughs> And angry. <laughs> and angry? Okay, good. Mm. And angry. Example. <laughs> uh, or, or, or I can say vice versa. Ingrid, imagine Ricardo. He's listening to Vicente Fernando full volume. Then it's like three in the morning, three in the afternoon. And he's singing. And drinking. Oh, because you can't see. You can't see. You, you just hear your neighbor. And your neighbor is Ricardo. But he's been listening to... <laughs> he started with Credence, and now he's with um, Vicente Fernandez. He must be drunk. He must be drunk. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but once again, you're not 100% sure because you're not there. You're not watching him. But it's it's, it's the level. Drunk. It's, it no, it's the level. Feet. It's the level of certainty. If yeah. you're very, very, very positive, you say he must. If you say he might or he could, it's less. You know, when you say he might or could, it's when you use this expression. He could be drunk. Sí. Yes. Uh, for example, um, let me see, let me see, let me see. Inmar. Inmar. I you know. You know what? Um, I want to ask a girl out, but I don't know because I see a ring on her finger. Uh, what do you think? You, you might to take it out. Oh, wow. No, no. <laughs> oh, hey, give me your finger. Give me your ring. No, no. Listen to this. I need an advice because um, I like this girl. She's very beautiful, but um, I see a ring on her finger. So, what do you think? Should I ask her out? Um, it could be a problem with her. I don't Why? advise you because she is married. You don't know. So you, you, you say she might be married. But I like I like what you said. Hey, that could be a problem because she might be married. Yeah. yeah. Because there are some women that use a ring and they're not even married, but you don't know. Yeah. Well, you must to ask her. You should ask her. You should. And so I'm going to put should have to. But right now, we're, you know, we're, we're talking about certainty. So my situation was like, 
man, I really like her, but she has a ring on her finger. And so he said, I don't know, man, be careful because she might be married. Yes? Yeah. Okay. Um, hi, Rosa. Uh, I can't hear you. Sorry, sorry. I okay. hear you. I'm I'm okay. Good. Um, I have a problem. I want to invite my wife to dinner tomorrow night, but I only have twenty five dollars, and she wants to go to La Pampa Argentina. You may you could use your credit card. No, I don't have credit cards. I only have twenty five dollars. <laughs> Okay, um, you may, you may, uh, could, so, so you what could, do you think, is $25 enough for two people in Pampa Argentina? No, of course not. <laughs> yeah. $25 is one, just one plate. Okay, so you, you can say, you know what, at $25 at might uh, not be enough. Uh, $35. You might to lend. <laughs> hey, you can share. You can share the plate. <laughs> no, or I let her ask. I let her ask for the plate. And when the waiter tells me, "And you, sir, um, coffee, please." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What, no, invite just her. Just uh, I'm, I'm, I'm not hungry. But, her. but you can invite her uh, pupusas. On, yes, there are pupusas. on Saturday. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. yeah. One dollar oh, each one. Oh, I didn't know that. One dollar each pupusa. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, but you know, in that sense, you can say, um, so so I'm telling you my situation, you know, I only have $25 and she wants to go to La Pampa and you say, you, you know must, what? You, you must go to the pupuseria yeah. instead. <laughs> you know, $25 might not be enough. But the problem is you, you, you have to go with with her at the Pampa. But if you are to invite to to eat pupusa, it's not a problem because you are in the Pampa, but eating pupusa. Yeah, but I don't think I don't think she would want to go eat pupusas to La Pampa. <laughs> Personally, I like Mama Chus. Wait for each. Yeah. La Pampa is really ridiculous expensive. I'm choose with with high do, like dollar for two people now. It's enough. Yeah. Oh, oh like ten dollars no. maybe. Ten dollars possible. Yeah. Ten dollar. Yeah. Yes. All right, good. So well once again, it's like certainty. Yes. Um Gio. What? Oh man. You know, <laughs> my wife recently she's been throwing up a lot like Whoa. and she everything makes her sick gives her nauseous you know like i don't know mm. she, you know she's it vomiting pregnant man she might <laughs> gonna she might no, it must it's a certainty because no, i because know she you. might be sick <laughs> <laughs> no i know you man. <laughs> no but you know you know you know actually today unfortunately <laughs> it can be two options <laughs> she might be pregnant or it might be COVID. <laughs> no, really. <laughs> yeah, when, when you know, because before it's like when somebody throws up, like, oh, oh man, definitely she may be pregnant. Yeah. But now, uh oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah. She could be. What is better? What is, what is better, pregnant or COVID? That's that's the that's the question. <laughs> Come in. Come in. Oh. Yeah, that's the question. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um. Good. So you understand, right? Might. Um, yeah. So remember, uh, might and could. It's um. Less than fifty percent. Yeah. And must is like. Definitely, you're sure. Definitely, yeah. You're not one hundred percent sure because you cannot confirm it. Because if you're very sure, then you don't say you must. Then you say, "Oh, she is pregnant." Mm. Yeah. You, you use you use could is a for is a for probability probability, but yeah, it's a recommendation. We're going to see those right now. Could should. 
Okay. So uncertainty, remember, must, might, and could. And, and you can put some character into like, I don't know, he, she could be pregnant. Mm. Or she must be pregnant. Man. There's, <laughs> there's no doubt. She's throwing up, <laughs> yes. Everything gives her nauseous, yes. Is she sleeping? Yeah, oh, no, definitely, man. She must be pregnant. Sorry, dude. <laughs> okay, next week, let's see what's next here. Less than 50%, sure. Models can also express obligation, advice, or opinions. You must be on time for the interview. Okay. You must be on time. It's not an obligation. You should wear a hat. It's an it's a advice. 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 Yes. And you should visit Paris. It's an opinion. Let's let's do a little bit more. Right now, let's do an obligation. I'm going to add an extra here because an obligation is must and have to. Have you heard of people say you have to, you have to be early, you have to wear a tie, and you must wear a tie? Yes. Do you know what is the difference between those two? You must uh, pay the bills on time. Okay. And you have to pay the bills on time. The two are correct. So, you know, then you say, okay, if the two are correct, then why do you say it differently? Why do you say you must and you have to? Uh, okay. Maybe, maybe must is, is an obligation um, and have to is an ob something you can decide do it or not. Right. Yeah, you're kind of you're kind of in the right sense here. Mm -hmm. Okay, when you say you have to and you say you must, the two are obligations. The only difference is that must is a legal obligation. Legal. Legal. Legal o autoridad. So you... Let's start. Yes, let's start right now with legal obligation. What is a legal obligation? What is something that you must do? You must Declare have the rent for voting. You I'm sorry? Must. You must have a duty for voting. Okay, yes. You must have a duty to vote. For vote De to vote. Yeah. Declaration of the rent. You must declare rent. I haven't like for four years, I think. Pay to pay. Uh, traffic. Yeah. You must pay taxes. Must. Um, you must carry your license driver drivers driver's license five, driver's license yes okay when, good when you drive good all those are legal obligations right you must be 21 to drink in El Salvador to drink liquor yeah you know. <laughs> yeah <laughs> 14 but legally <laughs> legally yeah, is 18 18 it's 18 oh okay legally yeah legally Oh, okay. You must you must be eighteen to go uh, to a bar. Okay. Yeah. You must be eighteen and over to and vote. Over. Okay, good. So that's a legal obligation. Now, the second type of legal obligation is authority. Do you know what is authority? Authority can be anything from your mother to your boss, um. anywhere you are. Okay, um, imagine your doctor. Your doctor can tell you, you must, you must stop smoking. You must stop sugar. Your doctor you can tell you that stop because eating pupusas and you nobody must accept that su stop su eating. Uh, suggestion. <laughs> yes, you must, yeah. you must cut pupusas, man. <laughs> I will suffer the day they tell me you must leave coffee. Uh, that I don't think I could do. 
I could do anything except coffee. Okay, but the reason why is because he's telling you an authority. Mm -hmm. Okay. When you say have to, es un igual. Let me give an example. Okay. Um, Ingrid is in human resources. And she hired, she hired Jaime and she hired Inmar. Okay, so in this in this in this case, Ingrid is the boss. And Inmar and Jaime are under in, in, in the work, right? So in this case, Ingrid can tell Inmar and Jaime you must wear a tie to work. Her authority tells you to wear a tie to work. But Inmar and Jaime, que dijo, Jaime, oh, you have to wear a tie to work. You have to. Yeah, you have to. Yes. So remember, um, when you're an authority, what is authority? Your doctor, if you if you study your teacher, if you work, your supervisor, your boss, if you are married, your husband, um, your wife. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I was I was waiting for the reaction. I was waiting for the reaction. I am joking. I am joking. I am joking. In that case, in that case, the two are authority. Because when your wife tells you you must. You know, yeah, you tell her. Okay. <laughs> but never, never will your son tell you you must. Right? You yeah. will tell your son. You must be here at 10, or if not, don't come. All right. Um, that's the difference. That's the difference. Have to and must. And this a legal obligation or authority is must, and have to is the same. That's similar like in Spanish. Debes de ir o tenes que ir. What is the difference? Debes de ir o tenes que ir. Debes es la legal, I think, o, o autoridad. Debes tener visa para viajar. Mm -hmm. O tienes que tener visa. You just have to. I'm sorry? In this case, you just have to or, or you just have to. You have to. You have to have a visa. Uh, I would say you must. You must. You must have a visa. Yes, because it's a rule. Must. It's it's, uh, it's una regla establecida, una ley. You must have a visa to. I mean, there's no option. You cannot go to United States without a visa, right? Legally. Legally speaking. Okay, so what do you think? Pay the bills, you must or you have to? If we're comparing must and have to. You must. You must. You must. You must. You must. You must pay the bill. Okay, I, I would say very, have very, to. But it's something very legal. <laughs> no, but I mean, it, it, don't it, pay it's... It? Yes, it's not legal. I mean, it's not illegal not to pay the bills. I mean, there's a yeah. consequence if you don't. Yeah, it's a consequence. Like they just cut your electricity. Come on, oh, okay, you don't want to pay? Good. But it's not something legal. Like they will not arrest you for that. Do you know like in the United States, if you get a, a ticket driving, the police gives you a ticket. And if you don't pay, you go to jail. Nice. Yeah, it's just a very good. Um, so you must pay. <laughs> See, that's no, it's not like it's like it's not like in Salvador. In Salvador, you have to pay, pero <laughs> pero that in Salvador is impossible. <laughs> Remember the bus drivers? There was one that he has like ten thousand dollars of tickets. <laughs> y lo yeah, y lo perdonaron because se van en huelga. I know. Yeah. Okay, so 
let's look at the example here. It says, you must be on time for the interview. Okay, that's an obligation. Oh, let me, let me give you another one. Um, child support. Do you know what is child support? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Can you explain to me, oh, can you explain what is child support for people that don't understand? It's the money that you should pay to your kid uh, when you abandon them. Okay, that you should pay or that you must pay? You must. Well, in El Salvador, maybe it's should. <laughs> no, you know, <laughs> you know, now I think it's must because I think if you don't pay, you get arrested. Yeah. Oh, you didn't know that. Yeah, I had a, he's not my friend, but I, there was a co-worker in the company. He really, he got arrested for not paying. That's good. And that's good. So now, now is, hey man, you must pay that. Or say, yeah, no, you have to. You must. Okay. So here it says you must be on time. Ricardo, can you give me an example with must or have to? Uh, I, I, I have uh, to get up early in the morning if I if I, uh, if I, I I be on time in my job. So I have to have to get up early in the morning. Early in the morning. Very good, Carla. Can you give me an example with must? I must study for the exam. I must study for the exam. Good. It must have been love, but it's over now. Remember that? <laughs> <laughs> but right there is a, uh, como es? Certain. Been. Been. She's being certain. It must have been love. Been. Hey, I admit it. Lo admito. I like pretty woman. I like that movie. <laughs> yeah. It's a classic. It's a classic. I have a big sister, that's why. So I remember when I was little, I watched all those ghost, <laughs> pretty woman, all those girl movies. So I like them. I don't like ghost. Oh, man, I cried in ghost. Yeah, it's sad, but you don't have to die to value another person. That is illogical. You have no heart. <laughs> no, I'm pregnant. It's true, Ingrid. You are realistic. It's <laughs> broken in one, two, three. <laughs> it's a love story. It's like it's like the notebook. Who the hell is no. going to stay with a person forever if she forgets who I am? They are in some insane love. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I remember I watched that movie with my wife and she got angry because <laughs> she says, if that ever happened to us, would you do that? And I said, no. <laughs> but really, I just, I was honest, like, no, where the hell am I going to do that if you don't, if you don't remember me? <laughs> and then she just started crying, like, are you, and I said, were you seriously asking me that? <laughs> so I should, I should have lied. I should have said, oh, yes, of course, I, I will every day live every day to to make you remember <laughs> i like romance and in details but i don't like that kind of liars <laughs> yeah that's true that is not true that is they are the, the movies they are good they are and and enter, entertaining yes that's good business <laughs> yeah of course yes Inmar, give me an example with have to or must Uh, oh, let's do one thing. I'm going to give you an example, and then you give me the advice, okay? Or okay. I I think my Dewey expires this month. You must have to to um, renovate. How do you say? Very good. Do you know how to say renovar class? Like renew? Renew. 
Renew. Renew. Renew. You must have to renew it. Okay, you must renew it. You must renew it. Can you repeat? You must renew it. Okay. You must repeat. renew it. Okay, very good, yes. So that was my situation. Oh man, I, I need to vote, but my, my Dewey expired. Oh no, man, they won't let you. You must renew it. Okay. Gio. Hey. Gio, what's up? Um, I bought a refrigerator in Walmart hmm. and it doesn't work. I bought it like a week ago and um, I, I give it all, I top it, and it doesn't feel cold. I don't know. Yeah. And I bought it new. You have to go to Walmart with the um, guarantee? Warranty. Warranty. Oh, okay. So, yeah, okay, good. So you have to, you have to go back to Walmart or you have to now return it to Walmart with the warranty. You have to Good. Do you go. Do you know what is the difference between guarantee and warranty? War warranty. Um, yeah, the, that's the thing. Um, in Spanish, it's garantia, pero in English, it's I guarantee you. Mm. I guarantee you will like that movie. I guarantee go, you have to you have to go to that restaurant. I guarantee you will like it. And the other is the document. The, the other is the document, the warranty. The warrant, warranty. Yes. Garantia que cuando compran algo in English is not guarantee, it's warranty. Warranty. Okay. All right. I just, I just remember the TV story you told us. <laughs> the what? The TV story that you oh yes that. in Walmart yes <laughs> yes it's a good thing I bought it new and I had warranty because <laughs> <it's not. laughs> okay good um Nelson hello Nelson how are you hello? Nelson you know I'm here. yeah you know what okay. I feel I or. A week, I have been feeling very, very sick. I throw up. I have a fever. I don't eat. And I ignore it because I say, oh, no, I will get better. But I don't. I, I don't get better. I get worse. Okay, so I, I must to, to visit. The I must or you must? You must. You have to. You, have um, to. you must. Yes, I must. Okay, you or me? Because, hmm. Ah, uh, you, you must okay. visit the doctor. Okay, very good. One thing, one thing. Really, you don't really visit a doctor. You go to the doctor. Because visit is like pleasure. Okay. And, you know, sometimes to visit a dentist is not pleasure. <laughs> no, you visit your family. You visit your friends. But come on, man. You vi I hope my wife is not listening because she's a dentist. <laughs> <laughs> But you visit a dentist, man, because you're gonna go have pain, like uh, yes. So remember, visit is more pleasure, and when it's business, is go. Go to uh, yes. Go to, go to. Yes. You, you must. You must go. Yes. This Rosalena, what is something I must do when I drive? You must pay attention when you drive. You okay. don't, you, it's correctly say you don't must. I'm sorry? It's correct. You say you don't must. You, you must not. That's very good. You okay. must not. The negative of must is must not. Must you not. must not 
watch the the phone, the cell phone. Oh, okay, good. Mm -hmm. Oh, aquí va un perfecto ejemplo. Eh, ¿Alguien lee la Biblia? Bueno. Sí. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yes, I, I read that. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> sometimes I, I was expecting I was expecting everyone to say yes I do I do okay. but okay we all do it si ustedes se dan cuenta cuando bueno en inglés cuando supuestamente se dan las reglas como es de autoridad siempre dice you must es que you, eh, 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 you, you must, must. Your, 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 your question <laughs> is not correct but you have uh, you have the Lees la Biblia, te, se la leen, se las leen, la cuestión. Well, it depends, yeah, because some people, yeah, but some people do read it. No, but if you notice, in, in, ese, en ese sentido, like the commandments, you must or you must not. Siempre usan must, they don't say have to. Yeah. Porque ahí está fuerte implementando una autoridad. You must and must not. Okay, very good. So, yes, when you drive, you must pay attention. You must use a seatbelt. You must have a license. Yes? Jaime. Jaime? Are you I, there? Yeah. Jaime, you, you are an accountant, correct? Mm, I don't know about that, yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, but. Do you have a title that says you're an accountant? I am an auditor. Oh, you're an auditor. An auditor. So where do I have to where or what must I study to become an auditor? GPA. I must study GPA. I study GPA at the university. Oh, okay, so I must study in a university to become an auditor. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Okay, good. So I don't want to send my auditor a seat, but hey, I want to be an auditor. It's a career. Uh, no, but you can study at the university, but after that, you need to make a, an, a, an authorization for the Consejo de Vigilancia. Oh, okay. Pública, to me, to good. My... But you see, you see what you said right there? After that, you need to, is you don't need to, you must, because it's a process. You, I, must, I must be, have an authorization for the Consejo de Vigilancia. Okay, there you go, very good, nice. All right, Ingrid. Hi. What is a must that you look for in a boy to date? Honesty. <clears throat> he must be honest. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. No, you know, <laughs> that's that's gonna be very difficult. <laughs> yeah, do, you have, do you have other musts? Because be honest, I, I'll be honest with you. That's very difficult. <laughs> no, that that is um, in in certain themes that I think that yeah. Yeah. I, okay. I, I think a point you know, this, that is, this is that. He mustn't be married. Okay, there you go. That's one. That in that in that he, kind of honest that I or okay. have a kind of commitment with another woman. That, okay. that is a point. Okay, so he must be single. Completely. He must be single. Uh, totally and, and, single. The words and, I don't know how to say you about applies. Widowed. 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 Yeah. And 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 uh, English and you read the, the Bible? Sometimes. <laughs> Oh, he, he, he must Shut read the Bible. Guy, Jaime. Seven women for every man. Seven women, yeah. That is a must. Yeah. No, but you know that that's a very good question right there because that's a very common question. Hey, what is what is a must for you? What is a must? Uh, okay. Uh, let me give you another example. Uh, Michelle. Michelle, you were sleeping. No, <laughs> I saw you, Michelle. You, oh. uh, that, my cat is around. So. Okay, um, Michelle, Michelle, do you, do you work? No. Oh, so cool. 
<laughs> okay. What do you, you study? I imagine. Yes, I do. What do you study? I study to become an English teacher. Where? At the University of El Salvador. How many years must you study to become an English teacher? A good English English teacher. Well, in the university, they are five years. You must study at least five years. Yeah. Listen to this. You must study at least five years because that's the minimum. Because mm -hmm. you know, you never you know. At least, a yes, at least. Mm -hmm. You can get oh. TH. Oh, okay. Ruth, where do you work? The company is Red Cell. Red Cell. Okay, uh, what is a must to work there? So this is similar to my question for Ingrid. Did you hear that? So Ingrid, what is a must to date you? What is a must for a boy to date you? And you know, okay, Ingrid said, okay, uh, honesty is a must and he must be single. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, I, can, I can ask Ruth. So what is a must to work in your company? I don't know. I don't, I don't understand the question. Like, I want to work in your company. What is a requirement, like a must? Uh, uh, that you speak and um, understand and write, write English. Okay. So English is a must in your company. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay, good. I have that. Yeah. You know, that, that's another question. You know, when you ask somebody, hey, man, I'm looking for a job. Where do you work? Oh, I work here. And what is a must right there? When the gente dice, hey, para entrar ahí, que, oh, man, to go in there, you know, <laughs> you must, you must speak English, French, and you must know about you must, this. You, you must, must uh, you must, uh, you must speak, uh, you must speak, read and write English. Okay, good. All right. Yeah, so um, that's how you say, oh, okay, no, no problem, you know, but to work there, you must, and then you say the requirements. Okay. Jordana. Yes. Hi. Uh, you are married, Hi. correct? Yes. Did you get married in a church? Yes. Uh, what are the musts to get married in the church? Mm, to have your like uh, how can I say ¿Cómo se dice matrimonio civil? First you have to have your you must have civil, the civil wedding civil wedding okay so you have to uh, you must have a civil wedding certificate and um, besides that you need to have all the los sacramentos uh, sacramento de la iglesia. Sacraments. Sac sacraments. Okay, Church yes. Sacraments. Yes, very good. You know, you know, I did everything in one day. Oh my God. Like Baptist. Money talks. Uh, no, Catholic, because I did not want to get married in church. That was my only condition. I told my wife, no church. I don't want religion. I don't want wedding. Pero. Yeah, I guess my wife is the must in the porque I, I got married in a church. <laughs> okay. she's the must. <laughs> yeah, she's the must because <laughs> yeah, she called my mom and my mom and me, me. So, but I remember when I went to, to talk to church, they asked me, "Do you have baptism confirmation?" And a lot of things. And Sean, 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 I said, "No, I don't have nothing." And, oh, it's okay, but you can do them all in one day. I did everything. Wow. <laughs> a marathon. Yes. <laughs> Which is one when they when they tell you <laughs> they tell you renuncias a Satanás and you have to say yes and they hate you. That's a confirmation. Uh, yes. Yeah. Oh man. Uh, they were recording me when they say that, that you know, like renuncias a Satanás. <laughs> I was thinking of ACDC, Highway to Hell. <laughs> but 
Yeah. You were thinking a lot. <laughs> yeah, I, I thought too much. You know, and and he hit me hard. Just to make sure. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and the voice inside. And you know what? And you must go to chats. Did you go to chats? Yes. Those were yeah. boring. Boring like chats. Four. Yes. Four. Yes. Uh, but yeah, so that that's really that's not that's not negotiable. If you get married in church, you must do all that. Right. So I, I did it. And one day I did it all. You must you must give up the, the devil. Yes, you must you must give up the devil. But they assume that you have the devil because they tell you. <laughs> yeah, that, that's very offensive because they don't ask you, do you have the devil in you? They just tell you, uh, do you do you quit the devil? And and you know, like, so I have the devil inside or what? <laughs> so they, yeah. Sometimes so sometimes you have the devil inside. Yeah, the devil. Yeah, sometimes we all do. So that was it. The all right. Excess tongue. Yeah, the devil inside, the devil inside. There is an, another, uh, that, that, like, no, there is another um, song, but there is a, um, a cover, I think, in interview of, of, a, of, a, of a vampire. Oh, that but that's sympathy for the, the devil. Vampire. Yeah, that is a good sympathy song. <laughs> hey, you post that song, right? Oh, I did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I love that song. Yeah, sympathy for the devil. Yeah, but you know, nice. I, I I did not like the Guns N' Roses version. I did. That's I mean, Rolling Stones, right? Yeah, compared, and I yes, heard another original. version, and I heard and I heard another that is fine. Yeah, I recommend you listen to that song. It's called "Sympathy for the Devil." Is the Rolling Stones? So he is singing that he is the devil, but people misunderstand that song. They think that oh, they're satanic. I know it's it's the irony because. He's saying, I watched you make wars. I watched you make kings. I watched you make kings. And all the devil was doing, just watching. Yeah, he's the devil. <laughs> yeah, so really, everybody works for the devil. It's a good song. So I love that song. All right. So next we have, it's cold. You should wear, should wear. a hat. So what is should? Is an advice? Opinion. Opinion. Or advice? Advice or opinion? Opinion. Mm -hmm. An advice or suggestion? Advice or suggestion. Yes. Although, you know, really, everyone should visit Paris once in their life. Yes, it's an opinion. But it's also an advice. So let's say it's an advice. So, um, Alexander, are you there? Okay, Laura, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Laura. Um... Oh. Laura, um... I'm having problems. Oh, look, there's your baby, Jordana. What is her name? Her name is Jordana, too. Yeah, you know, I asked you that because I imagine she was going to have a unique name. Yes, she has. Do they call her Jordi? My family <laughs> call me Jordi, but we call her Dana. Dana, oh, nice, nice. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh. oh, nice. All right. Um, okay, so Laura. I don't hear, what is the question? No, no, I haven't. I haven't made you the question yet. Mm -hmm. I want you to give me an advice. So what do you think, Laura? My wife keeps on throwing up. She vomits all the time and she gets sick. She gets dizzy. I don't know. Um, you know, I don't know what's going on. Uh, she should go to the doctor. A specific, a, a doctor especially a specialist in brain. In the brain. <laughs> yes. 
<laughs> oh my god that's pregnant. <laughs> okay i was thinking more like she should get a pregnancy yeah, some test psychological <laughs> yeah, so she should go to a psychologist. To a psychology. Maybe. No, the brain doctor is the psychiatrist. Or, <laughs> yes, or another specialist like um, um, I don't know, how do you say? Uh, Otorrino, Laringolo. Okay. You say the same otorhinolaryngologist. Okay. What? I like how I like how Laura, you jump from top. You don't escalate like from the bottom. <laughs> you solo like boom. Okay, that's good. She should uh, she should go to a specialist. Correct, Laura. Yes, I get it. No, no, it's correct. So, you, in your opinion, your advice is that she should go to a specialist. Yes, she should go to a specialist. All right, good. Anybody else can give me an advice? Maybe you should, you should visit a gast gastro... Entologist. That. <laughs> that. <laughs> really? Okay. Okay, good. Maybe she might have parasitos. Parasites. <laughs> <laughs> okay okay or oh, it's all on my basic man like you know she should get a pregnancy test <laughs> yeah it should be <laughs> should be, should be make a covid test or she should get a covid test okay yeah okay good only you you should should get a pill yeah you know, or or this is what I would say. You know, you should you should make numbers. <laughs> it should be a number. <laughs> yeah, because you know th that's why you start. I, I imagine that's what you do. Okay, wait. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh my God! Yes, it's a problem. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> you know, like when you start making numbers. And then the next step is you go to the um, pharmacy and you buy that stick. Yeah. Right. Positive or negative. <laughs> All right. Okay. Uh, Veronica, are you there? Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> listen, Veronica, sometimes I need to listen to relaxing music, but you know, like, please don't say heavy metal because I know that's how you relax. And I like that. <laughs> But I, I need some relaxing music, you know, like just to sit back and control. Yeah. Relaxing music, you know, like maybe music to put me to sleep. Okay. What do you recommend? Uh, okay, you, you should listen to a, a playlist and like a, a spa music. Or a relaxing spa music. music. Oh, okay. Yes. Oh. Or yoga music. Oh, good. Or nature sounds? Uh, nature sounds. Uh, I like the nature sounds. Uh, sounds. And oh. put the, 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 oh, I don't know. How do you say the, the vaporizer or the olores? <laughs> I don't know. The what? I don't have idea. The what? No, no, pones on una para el olor. ¿Cómo se llama? Incense, incense, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, yes. Incense. In, uh, yeah. Yeah. Incense, yes. <laughs> incense, yes. Wow. For relaxing. You are deep. <laughs> yeah. I like listening to jazz. When ah, like jazz relax, is good. Yes, of course. But then I don't relax because I, I like to listen to Sebastian Bach. Yes, it's true. Mozart, I like listening to Mozart. 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 <laughs> so yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sebastian Bach. There's, <laughs> there's a Spanish singer también que se llama Sebastian Bach, right? Yeah. Ah, no, but this is, this is yeah. a, a, <laughs> Yo me a, quedo. A, a kind of Moses Weir. No, yeah, it's I a, said, a, a symphonic Sebastian. music. Johan Sebastian. No. Así se llama Joan Sebastian Bach. Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> Con qué derecho te puedes poner encima? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Joan Sebastian Bach. Bach. 
It's a, it's a horrible music. Mm -hmm. Yes. I like Enya. Have you heard Enya? Enya, yeah. That, that's cool. Sell away. Sell <laughs> away. Yes. <laughs> no, uh, only time. All the time. That's a good song. That's a good song. All right, cool. It's like so, music for Avatar. <laughs> yes, it's like I don't, yeah. There was another group that I don't think they exist anymore. They were called Enigma. Enigma, Enigma that's very yeah. good music. Yeah, they were good. I like yeah. it. What happened to them? They still mm -hmm. they still they disappear. Oh. And you teacher, you you listen Gregorian music? Do you like it? No, I've heard I've heard it, but really I have never like put it as background music. No. There is a, a DJ, a, a Canadian DJ, but it's an um, indie. It's really good. Cool. It's named the Contra Boy. It's really Contra nice. Boy. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, okay. Contra Boy. I will write that down right now. It's, it's, I'll listen to it. He has interesting music. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice. Thank you. All right. And Rosa, one more. Yeah. So going back to this dinner tomorrow, I only have $25 and my wife wants to go to a nice place. What do you recommend? Um, you can go to... You should go to... You should mean to... Sure. You should mean to go um, sushi in the... The sushi bar. It's Where? Not expensive. The sushi is in the Hunan building. In, in the Hunan building, in the same the oh, same building. Oh yes. But it's the second floor. It's a buffet, correct? Yeah. Mm -hmm. How much is it? It's like ten dollars, correct? Something like that. Or all you can eat sushi. All you can eat. Where? That's, that advice, was the... <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Before the the, the, the pandemic was in that way, I don't know how it's now. Yeah, not that close. <laughs> I remember that the, the buffets when you know when they say buffet nine ninety nine, you say wow that's cheap, and it's true. And you go, it's like nine ninety nine. Y la bebida no incluye bebida. How much is the drink? Four ninety nine. Like oh okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's the catch. <laughs> <laughs> no oh, okay yeah i remember and you're not you know maybe maybe i will go maybe i will go it's good. I, I i like sushi it's good. i, I love like sushi, sushi too. she yeah, doesn't like sushi good. very much but but i do sushito sushito okay. yes sushito is delicious koi 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 have you ever eaten the salvadorian roll no, no. no. Uh, with a platano. Platano. <laughs> yes. With a Teacher, how do you say loroco in English? Loroco. 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 Yeah, Loroco. No, the, no. Um, I tasted the uh, Salvadorian sushi in in Super Selectos. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I had I had a craving. Do you know what is craving? Okay. I, Desire. Looking for, uh, looking craving for and oh, yes. Yeah, okay. Let me write that for you. Craving. And the I food in the in in Selectos are good in in. Yes. in in Cascadas, the pizza is really nice. Oh, it is. Okay, I was there and I asked for, a, and, I, and I said a Salvadorian roll. Okay, and it's the sushi, you know, the rice, and then they put plantain, beans, and avocado. <laughs> and they roll it. But it was, it was interesting. I liked it. <laughs> I liked it. I thought it was interesting. Okay, now I am hungry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, class, then um, have a very, very nice weekend, okay? You too. Thank you you so, can go you to too. it. Teacher. 
Yes. Thank you. So remember, in we can go to you. Yeah. You too. so remember, in conclusion, have to and must is the same. But if you ever wonder, if you want to go the extra mile to wonder, so what is the difference? If it's the same, if you're one of, if, if you're one of those type of people that, okay, that's the difference because must would be illegal and have to is down. Equal. Equal. Well, yes. Equal. Mm -hmm. Okay. So example, you will never tell your boss in the job, you must be here tomorrow at six. <laughs> I may. <laughs> yeah. You you know, you tell me, hey, if I remember that tomorrow you, you have to be here at six. Mm -hmm. He can tell you. All right. Yeah. Yeah, he can say like Gio, uh tomorrow you must be here at five, okay? What oh, yeah, sure, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay. Oh my God, I, I wrote craving and privado to everyone. Craving is. There you yeah. go. Okay. What so you say, mean? Antojo. So you say, I have a craving, craving for chocolate. Craving. I have a craving for pastelito de picado today, but I can't oh, okay. eat that. Yeah, I was with that craving yesterday. Yeah. Now I have a craving for sushi. Okay. Yeah. Okay, class, then have a great weekend. Okay. Thank I'll you. see you Monday. Wow. Thank you. Bye bye. 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 Bye.